Your organization has a lot of Power BI report and suddenly a name of a data set has changed or a measure has changed. Your reports will be broken. Let's see what we can do without going to each visual, fix it individually. This is a Power BI report that we want to fix. Step number one. We have to rename the extension into a zip file. This is actually a zip file. Step number two, delete the security binding files. We can delete the file and we have to, in step number three, change the content of this file. Because we are working within the zip file, we cannot edit it directly. And we are going to do this in Notepad++. This is the section that we have to delete. It's also related to security binding because we deleted the file. This was the infrastructure of the report and now it's the main report, the layout. Again, we have to copy first and open it with Notepad++. Do not open it with Notepad because it leaves some footprint. This file looks better if we format it as a JSON file. You see the structure is not very readable for the human but we will replace our old data set name receivable state with receivable transaction so let's just replace all we have to be careful about the prefix suffix and everything you have to study this depends what you do okay here 900 times we save the file and we replace the other one file is slightly bigger because we added the text here. Step number four is the final step where we just have to rename the file back. When we open the file, we can see that all the visuals that were belonging to receivable state are now fixed. Now this one, it is not because this is actually belonging to another data set. So we have to repeat the exercise until we rename all the names that have been changed 